So it's the 25th of May 2021 and Banshee44, he's got a weekly inventory of weapons. I see each week on Tuesday at reset his inventory rotates, where you can pick up a selection of whirlpool weapons with random rolls. It's well worth checking out his inventory to see if there's anything you missed or if he's got some god rolls available to purchase. So today and each week I'm going to go through what he's selling so you can decide whether it's worth checking in or not. Well, if you're new around here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below for all the latest Destiny 2 content and turn on notifications by hitting that bell. So Banshee44, he could be found in the tower. So what you want to do is land in the courtyard. The land here. You can find Banshee44. He's hiding under the stairs. Let's check out and see what Banshee's got this week. But this week, he's got the Seventh Seraph Carbine, and this one comes with fourth times the charm, moving targets. This one's really, really useful. This is a kinetic weapon, and this can produce Warmind cells. So I definitely recommend picking this one up if you haven't got it. Then we've got Toil and Trouble. This one is a shotgun. Aggressive frame. This one has pulse monitor. The outlaw. Not too bad. But I would say give that one a miss. We've got truth teller. This one comes with blinding grenades, grave robber, multi kill clip. That one's a really good one. I would recommend picking that one up. Then we've got Pleiades corrector. This one is a scout rifle. It's a lightweight frame. This one. This one again has four times the charm and elemental capacitor. Not really sure about this one myself. I would probably rather go for the Hung Jury. I'm on the fence about this one. Next up, we've got the Seventh Seraph Saw. This is a high impact frame power machine gun. This one comes with auto loading holster and opening shot. That's quite a good perk combination. Also, this one has the benefit of creating Warmind cells. So I would recommend picking this one up. And finally, we've got Tarantula. This is a power linear fusion rifle. This is a precision frame. Comes with pulse monitor and box breathing. And linear fusion rifles did get a buff this season. So again, I would recommend picking this one up. There's a few there this week I would recommend. So we've got the Seventh Seraph Carbine. Always really useful for generating Warmind cells. We've got a Truth Teller. That is a handy grenade launcher to have. The Seventh Seraph Saw. Another really good power machine gun again for creating warmind cells and it's really good for those warmind cell builds and also tarantula too well that is it for banshee 44's weekly weapons on the 25th of may 2021 and if you want to buy any of his stock head to the tower and pick up the weapon of your choice well as always thank you so much for watching and for more destiny 2 content like this like subscribe and share with a friend to join our community, check out the Discord link in the description. And you can follow me on Twitter at TWIVG Podcast. If you enjoyed this video, found it useful, liking and sharing the video would really help me out. Otherwise, check out the other videos on the channel. Thanks again. See you in the next video.